hello there and welcome back to my channel subscription boxes and more with Michelle and if this is your first visit well I hope it won't be your last what is it I'm here to share with you today guys I've got this big box here clear full of things to unbox but we're gonna start out with hmm how about a tea meal I opened it to make it a little faster first thing out of the box is a shirt or bag, not box. And it's for Valentine's Day, guys. It is a sweatshirt. It's not, um, it's not a fleece lined sweatshirt. I don't know if you can see. It's kind of got a texture. So it's heavier than a t-shirt, but not as thick as a fleece lined shirt. And it's got two kitties. It says, you're so pretty. <laughs> so pretty. So, I will try this on at the end of the video. That is so cute. I love the um, vintage kitty cats on there. Like the Valentines uh, back when I was a kid. So, I'm sorry you can hear my sister's shampooing carpets. I got one of these the other day for my mom. And she liked it so well. I got one for myself. Now, I'm not going to open it because it's got the um, adhesive in there. And I don't want to lose it. But it goes on the wall, and uh, it holds your glasses. And the cats keep knocking my glasses down, and then they end up on the floor, and I can't see without them to, you know, in that kind of a distance. Like, I'm afraid I'll step on them when I get up to find them, or they go into the bed and I can't find them. And so anyways, it's to hold my glasses. And Mom liked her so well, I got one for me. So I got more Barbie shoes because I order something and then I don't realize I already ordered it and I end up ordering it again. But um, I didn't get any black shoes the last time and it looks like this one does have a pair of black shoes. So I don't mind that I ordered them. It made, makes me pay like a dollar something or two something for one pair of shoes. No, I know it's a whole bag of shoes, 20 pair, but I wanted specifically a black pair. So. I didn't need all the other colors because I already have all the other colors. But the black shoes that came with Abby's outfit won't stay on her feet. They're, they just don't fit. Um, she's got very tiny feet that are really, really, you know, up on the toes. So, um, not all shoes fit her. Um, but anyway, there is a little pair of black heels. I'm going to hold it by the heel. So those are cute, huh? And, um, please do not chew on mommy's stuff, Mr. Sir. No. Guys, there are glass slippers. Okay, so I paid that for a couple pairs of shoes. There are some pink pearly boots with a butterfly on the back. Those are interesting. Like lace up high heels, but so those aren't too. I mean, they're kind of out there, but um, and there are some lacy red boots. <laughs> so, uh, yeah, there's like, and there's an orange, there's these bright green, like fluorescent green, uh, nice pair of purple ballet slippers, and she's up on her feet, uh, toes like she's dancing the ballet so anyways um that's just a few pair there's there's 20 pair here um and i like it enough just for the black ones and the clear ones and um i do like those purple ballet slippers because as i said she's kind of like she's um on point so i'm gonna set these over there so i because the cat I don't want a cat eating a shoe. I have a cat, Charlie Bill, who is chewing like a puppy. So if you have a cat that chews a lot on things, if you can give me a suggestion to get him to stop, please, I would love you forever because he, he's um, gone through in two days, three, count them, one, two, three, of my mom's um, cords for her, her tubing for her oxygen. 
and uh, only had four. So we're on the fourth one. If he shoots a hole in it, and we had to tape it already. So if you have a, a suggestion that won't hurt my cat, let me know in the comments below. All right. So let's go back to unboxing. We got another doll. They come with their head removed. I think for safety reasons possibly or to make them just fit in the box better I don't know but you got to put their head on and they do come in the nude sorry I shouldn't be showing a nude doll um, but that's how they come and let me get her out I'll try to cover her I'm gonna put her head on down here so that uh, anyways come on guys it's, it's a Barbie doll um, but I feel weird about it, so, but anyways, um, I'll try to cover her body as much as I can, so the, you just t take her head, hold her hair out of the way, and pop her head on, you want to push it down farther than it needs to go, the farther than you think it needs to go, and then pull it back till it goes into that kind of a ring and ta-da, you have a doll with a head. I'm going to try to keep her... Oops. Um, she's got kind of a, a strawberry blonde hair going on. Um, no bangs. Brown eyes. So, um, for a friend for Abby. Um, I got some stickers. To, for my journal, um, I think these might be like St. Patrick's Day ones, I think, possibly. And I see a lot of green. I didn't realize I ordered these, but they were um, on sale. Yeah, there's, these are St. Patrick's Day. Here's this. The reason I'm saying they're St. Patrick's Day is because, see? And I like the vintage look. Um, let me find a couple more to show you, and then we'll go on to something else. Um, they're St. Patrick's Day, but also, like, very botanical. So, you can use them anytime. Um, and see, it says, like, nature. So, that's why I got these, specifically. But then you have the more St. Patrick's Day looking ones. Um, trying to find a couple more, like, like this dude. And then you have this one that says what? Well, I showed it to you upside down. We wear the green and stitch it to St. Patrick's Day and think of you. Okay. And then, you know, things like, oh, things like thrown on the floor, like tags and things like that. And then there's even a gnome. Last one I will show you because. So, anyway, so they can be used more than just St. Patrick's Day. Um, I've not, I was trying to journal every day and I was doing really well for a little while and then I broke the habit. You've got to, uh, to make or break a habit takes, uh, they say, 21 days. Well, I didn't get quite to the 21 days. Um, the neighbor lady that has no clothes on has a son and he does have clothes on. Just because I thought this little guy was just so cute. And he's got lots of articulation. Um, so his head does turn. Doesn't really have much articulation in the neck. But I mean it just turns back and forth. But his shoulders and his wrists and his elbows. So he has good articulation there. He uh, bends at the waist. Oops, his pants fell down. 
<laughs> and at the knees and at the ankles. So he's got a lot of articulation. Um, and he's just, he's just cute. He's got kind of a big head, but he's cute. Then we have some vintage Valentine stickers. I told you I like vintage Valentine and stuff. Uh, because these are the kind of Valentines that we had when I was a kid. Like this one. What does it say? According to my references, you'd make a swell Valentine. And then there's like ones that are less cartoony. You know, because it's, anyway, one with a kitty cat. All my love. Oh, here's another one with a cat. Apparently, this one has a lot of cats. Shoe enough, shoe enough, you are my valentine. Cat in a shoe. A couple of kids. Another cat. You couldn't see them. I mean, they only show just a very few. So I didn't know there were so many cats. Oh, look at this cute little, cute little boy. Cute little elephant. I'll give that one to my sister because she loves elephants. And the doggo. So anyway, and I remember this one specifically in a box of Valentines. So, oops, yikes, I'm losing them. The doggo went on the floor. Okay, so let me put that back in the package because I really don't want to play 50 sticker pickup. So these are not in, um, ones that, I mean, they're all Valentine's. So it's not like you can use them at the times, like the Nature-y and St. Patrick's Day ones. So they're specific to Valentine's Day. And then we have, okay, I got this little baby thinking that uh, the measurements that they gave made it sound like it was more the size of the doll, the silicone baby that I have, uh, baby Gracie. It is not. It is much bigger. It has articulation, but so I got it for the outfit. But it is, I mean, much, much, it, it's like good four or five times at least the size. So, yeah, that's not going to work. And, I mean, over her body. Um, let's see if I can cover her up enough to... This baby is quite large for a Barbie-sized doll, so... Oh, I threw it on the floor. So, but I may be able to take the outfit and take it apart and use it kind of as, as a pattern and like shrink it down, possibly. And I may try to do that. Um, but it's much, 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 much too big. We have, and then being much, much, much too small, um, this, again, measurement-wise, sounded like it was going to work. It is definitely 112th scale, or even smaller. Oh, guys, it is so tiny. I'll show you. If I can even get it open. The way they put the sticker on it, how are you even supposed to get it open? The sticker is bigger than the package. I'm so disappointed. Hang on, I'll show you. Look at this baby bottle. Do you see the size of it? I mean, next to my, it's not, it's like from my first knuckle to my, again, our naked Barbie. Try to cover up her body and hold out her hand. The size of it in her hand. Do you see it? It's just way too small. It's a bottle of milk. Ugh. 
but the little bib will fit. Show you that. The bib is open, I mean not open in the open. Not open in the back. I would have to cut it. The bib would fit. Hopefully you can see them. And it came with a little, it came with another bottle. It came with a pink one and a blue one. And a thing of like baby oil. Much too small. Alright, well, that's unfortunate. Those are more like, I'm going to keep them because they're more like the size for the doll houses that I make. Um, I made one and showed it on the, my channel um, that are more, not even, I don't even think they're one twelfth scale. I think they're much smaller yet than that. And I can use it in there. Uh, one last item in this order. And it is a duplicate of the stickers, so that will go in my giveaway. Some things you have to order, like, you have to order two or whatever, or you can't order it because they have it so inexpensive. Or I accidentally click on it more than once and order it more than once. So regardless, this is going to go in the giveaway, and it's got all those nature stickers, don't forget, so somebody will get that. Um... I do want to show, hang on, uh, I do want to show the giveaway, um, I wanted to keep it all a secret, but it seems like not, like people are thinking, well, they're just getting a doll, so they're not interested, um, there is the doll, the doll clothes, the mini-verse thing, but there is in here, it's C, Z by J, or K, J, L, which is Kenneth, J Lane or something like that. It's a cubic zirconia uh, bracelet. Blingy blingy bracelet. Some designer. Very blingy. It's really pretty. And it comes in an organza bag. And then there's a 60% off coupon thing if it's any good anymore. I think it is. I'm leaving it in there. The bag of clothes and stuff for the doll. There's by VC, whoever that is, a designer bracelet. Vertical Collective. It's really pretty. It's got little discs hanging. Oh, yikes. Michelle, don't lose it. And it's in this little, like, envelope. There is a sponge gel. You have my heart. It smells really good. And I know that sponge gels are really popular. There is the cat lady. Every day is a new chance to pounce on happiness and stuff. The um, um, thing of coasters. There is... Able Skincare London Anti Aging Retexturing and Resurfacing Duo Moisturizer. There are two different lip glosses Dirty Little Secret. Um, one is cherry, one is orange. There is Laritzi, Laritzi Cosmetics Halo Dupot. It looks smudgy, but it's never been touched. It looks like it has, but it really hasn't. It's never even been opened until just now. Um, there is... 
good vibes, good life, good, good uh, vibes, good life, how self-love is the key to unlocking your greatness. Book by Vex King. And there will be more in the box probably. This is just what I have in there at this moment. And of course the doll. Um, and the miniverse. So it's not all doll related. It, it's a lot of things. So I really hope that you will go. It, it will be, the link will be um, at the top somewhere at, uh, during this video. And um, probably in the description if I remember to put it in there. So there's a lot to the giveaway other than the doll. And whatever else will fit in this box will go in here. And I will make sure that it's good and full. So there will be some surprises. But guys, it's not all Timu stuff. It's not all... No, it's... I think it's worth going back to that giveaway video and commenting is what I'm trying to say. So I hope you'll do that. So anyways, uh, and that giveaway is going to go till the first and I will draw on the first. So please tell me what you think of my Timu video and please give me a big old thumbs up because you know that would really help my channel and please subscribe to my channel and please share this video with others so that maybe they might subscribe as well and also so that they can see what is going to be in that video or what the video that giveaway so maybe they'll go back and watch that video and maybe they will subscribe and they will you know sign up for the giveaway and thank you so much for watching and for listening to me babble. And I'll see you again in a minute in another video. Don't go away. I am going to try on the shirt. I almost forgot. Hang on. But hang on. And the shirt I had on was also a Timu shirt. Hey, this is a nice shirt, guys. Nice. It comes down uh, low enough. And the, sh the sleeves are fine, too. I just don't... They're long because I've short and I always push my first thing I do is push my sleeves up I always push my sleeves up but as you can see it's plenty roomy I like it all right I'm gonna just wear it I'm gonna wear it for the next video <laughs> all right guys I just sat on I sat on this poor doll um anyways guys Mwah. see you in a get again in a minute guys bye and I'm tongue-tied too